YouTube, this is Puck. Today uh, we're gonna upgrade the Android tablet, the 5. Point, what was it? 5.0, the Lollipop. We're gonna upgrade it to 5.02. Cause uh, I just got from my friends, the developers, the latest link to uh, the 5.02 Android Lollipop. It's the latest, but this is a special version because this is the version for x86 tablets or for laptops and yeah other x86 uh, machines such as normal computers so we're gonna do it on uh, the tablet that we use to install uh, Android 5 lollipop uh, onto and it's the few sonic few pad 10 it's standing right here in front of me it's already running uh, Linux 5 so come a little closer and come see how we gonna do that welcome back youtube well here we are this is the usb stick and this is the tablet and you can see it's it's a tablet with a with a keyboard because you will need a keyboard to you know um to do the first things but in fact the installation um will be of course after that a uh, fully touch screen so um yeah what kind of tablet is it let me first show it to you let me remove it out of the cover. This is it. It's a very beautiful tablet. Made several videos about it uh, already. It's the Fusonic ViewPad 10. It's not been created anymore. This is metal. This is real quality, you know. This is glass. This is not plastic. It is capacitive screen and not a resistive or resist resistive. Don't even know how to say that. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this USB stick. Yeah. And we're gonna put it in to the machine and this thing has a bios so this cannot be done on any you know uh, tablet the ones that you buy for you know with android the cheap cheap rotsoy not those you know this can only be done on a tablet uh, that came with windows you know yeah so we're gonna turn it on and I'm gonna hit F11 so I can choose the boot. There you go, F11. I'm pressing F11. And here you can see that now I can boot. Yeah, but uh, the boot didn't go too good. So let me hit F11. Sometimes I have a little bit of issues with okay there you go now we can choose to start from uh, cd-rom let me bring this thing a little bit closer so you can see it there you go see that we're gonna choose of course to start up from the flash disk okay so we're gonna say install Papa. Because it already had Android on it. It already has a version of Android on it. Only thing we're gonna do, we're gonna leave everything like it is. We're just gonna hit SDA1 and we're gonna say format as an X3. Okay? And then up here it will say you choose to format SDA, blah blah blah. Are you sure you want to, you know? Yes, I'm sure. So it's partitioning, formatting. At this time and this installation won't take too long because uh, in fact we already had uh, we already had the Linux distribution or I mean a Linux partition on this tablet so you know if we had some Windows uh, partition on the tablet then this would not work because the formatting uh, program of uh, Android is not so I think it's not so so strong Okay, here we go. Do you want to install bootloader as grip? Please answer here. Yes. And do you want to install a system directory as read write? Making the system be read write is easier for debugging, but it needs more disk space and longer installation time. Yo, let's go for it. Okay. We just hit yes here. So it's going to write it now. Expect to write 61 or 619,176 KB going pretty fast as you can see
okay so this is it and uh, in my previous uh, installation my touchscreen was not working so up here we can run Android or reboot we're gonna set it to reboot remove the stick you see that and now we're gonna boot from the tablet and now it should boot straight up to Android if everything went right it should boot straight up to Android so this is the way how to uh, upgrade uh, your Android version because now we have Android 5.0.2 and well we just take a look if the guys already uh, created the fix for um, for my beautiful uh, ViewSonic ViewPad 10 because the touchscreen was not working uh, in version 5 I made a video about that it <laughs> embarrassed me a little bit because all the previous versions uh, Touchscreen never had no problem with the touchscreen, never ever. But in uh, Android 5, you know, uh, the ViewSonic Touch part was not uh, ready yet. And let's see if it's ready now. It's ready now, peeps. They fixed it. Look at that. Wow. Look at that. Android 5 running and up. 5.2 and eh? let's go to the settings and let me show that oh look at that oh my god look at that i'm so happy that the guys fixed yo developers out there yo big box from puck you know respect from puck love from puck you know you guys are the best here you can see it says uh, manufacturer uh fuel sonic feedpad 10 see that 502 android version baseband unknown amazing 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 so it uh yeah it worked uh we did an update from um from android 5 to 5.2 and well this is in fact how to do it peeps it was not so hard as you could see so uh, i'll put the, the download links to um to this android version so you can also download or download it and start installing it on your acer tablets that run uh, windows your few few sonic uh, tablets out there this thing came with windows 7 and android 1.6 but at this moment it still beats most of the tablets you see out there this thing has a dual core anthem processor no big deal 1.6 uh, per processor you know uh, but it's fantastic it runs amazing run windows 10 this thing can even be a mac tablet installed mac os x uh, uh, x86 on this thing as well you know the i at cost version so yeah that's it peeps that's how to do it well peeps that was it it was not so hard uh, i'm happy i have my android tablet i can now remove it out of the case you know make sure that the battery is full and i can take it to any location with me running android lollipop and i'm really happy that this project went right now it's time for a cup of coffee so peeps i want to thank you for watching uh, if you liked this video of course like subscribe and um, be sure to watch my other video uh, about the same tablet that i'm gonna use to uh, create the 2015 10 inch uh, Linux tablet. Yep, yep.